Hello, everybody. Thank you all so much for taking the time. I really appreciate you guys all logging in today. Um, so first off, I, I want to take a second to introduce myself. Um, my name is Dan Vogt. I'm currently an event consultant and customer support specialist over here with Whova. Um, we're the technology provider today. I'm sure most of you have already gotten into the system and kind of played around, um, but I do want to take a second to introduce you to all the different tools and show you the different access points that you guys are going to have throughout the day. Um, so to begin, um, you have two main ways of accessing all the content. You can download the mobile event app. Um, it's already available in the Apple App Store. Most of you should have already received an email with the download link, or you can just type in Whova on the App Store. And then we also do have a desktop version available as well. Um, so you should have gotten an email with that link, um, but definitely let us know if you're having any troubles accessing that. So I just want to take a second and, and kind of show you um, the sign-in process for those of you who might not be familiar with it. So you should have received an email that looks something like this. All you need to do is just click the download button. Um, our app is available in both the Apple App Store and the Google Play Store. Then all you need to do is click through, open it up. I already have it downloaded. You're going to want to click the sign in button and then for the sign in process, you're just going to want to enter in the email address that you registered with on Eventbrite. Um, if for some reason you forgot that you can always just search for the event in the uh, find my event tool, just type in virtual blockchain and it'll pop up and then you just need to use the invitation code in the email to log in. So what I'll do is I'm just going to enter in my email address. Create a quick account. And I would recommend taking a little bit of time. If you want, you can pair this up with LinkedIn and kind of pull in your information, but I would spend a little bit of time um, just filling out your profile information because this is basically um, going to be your networking profile and your social profile in the application. But I'm going to skip past most of this stuff. So as soon as you finish that up, you're going to be taken directly to the event. And this is basically what the homepage of the event is going to look like on the mobile side. Um, so as you can see here, you have access to a ton of different resources. There's games built into the application. Um, and just to orient everybody, if you see at the very bottom, this is basically gonna serve as your hub. So you can refer to the program down there, and then you're also able to actually directly engage with everybody who's coming to the event um, through one-to-one -one messaging and through sharing on the community board. So I, I first wanna just take a second and kind of show you guys how to pull up the live stream. So you're just gonna click on this agenda icon on the very bottom. And then we're just going to go into this welcome section. And then all you need to do is just click into the live stream link and this will take you directly to the live stream. And the exact same thing is going to be available on the desktop. So let me just show you how that works. So you should have received a link like this. Um, if you've already created an account, you can just use the exact same password as the mobile app password. If you haven't, there should be a temporary password included in the email. And definitely let us know if you're having any issues getting signed in. So once you get in here, this is basically going to be the home page. Um, and then you can just click into the agenda and then just click into live stream. And this will allow you to pull up the live stream directly within the system. So some other quick things, um, just referring to that bottom bar, you do have an attendees section and you also do have a community board available as well. Um, this attendee section is great for making connections. So you can use this to find people to reach out to. We'll give you smart recommendations up at the very top. So if there's anybody specific um, that shares interest with you, um, you can reach out directly to them. And then once you do find someone to connect with, you're able to directly send them messages. You can set up meetings within the system and even exchange contact information if you want to. In addition to that, um, 
I would recommend taking a look at the community board because this will really bring things together for you guys. Uh, you can basically think of this as like a giant forum for um, everybody to interact and engage in. And, you know, I'd recommend, you know, sharing pictures, posting photos within here, just introducing yourself in general. One of the cool features that you guys can use is this virtual meetup. We've had a lot of our events um, that have been using this for like virtual coffee hours or um, you know, cocktail hours. So definitely feel free to get creative with this. Awesome, well, that about does it. I really wanna thank you all um, for taking a second to, to look at this with me. And if you guys have any questions at all, um, definitely feel free to reach out. I'll be on the community board to help you guys out. Um, I also know Jack and, and Ashton are really well trained in the system as well and can help you guys out. But we're really excited that you all came out and um, hope you guys enjoy everything. Thanks.